why do we often tie our happiness to the presence of others, external achievements, and validations? Tonight, let's embark on a journey into the depths of our hearts and minds. The pursuit of happiness can take us on various paths, but let's explore a different one, one where happiness begins and ends within ourselves. Imagine a life where your contentment and joy are not dependent on the presence of another person. Picture a scenario where your fulfillment isn't a borrowed ray of sunshine from someone else's sky, but a light that radiates from within you. This is not a mere fantasy, it's a possible reality, a state of being that we can all achieve with understanding and effort. Some might question if this is about isolating ourselves from the world, and the answer is a resounding no. This is about discovering the untapped well of happiness within us, independent of the external world. It's about learning to enjoy our own company, valuing our thoughts and dreams as much as those of others. In our lives, we play numerous roles, friends, partners, colleagues. We are social beings craving connections and interactions. But amidst these connections, we often lose sight of the most crucial relationship we will ever have, the relationship with ourselves. We forget to listen to our inner voice, to nurture our inner world, and to appreciate the beauty of our own solitude. Being happy alone doesn't negate the joy of relationships, instead, it enhances them. When you are content with yourself, when you appreciate your own presence, you bring a stronger, more authentic self to your relationships. Your happiness becomes a gift you share, not a gift you seek from others. To embark on this journey of self-contentment, we must peel away the layers of societal expectations and norms. We must unlearn the idea that solitude is something to be avoided, that being alone means being incomplete. We must embrace the concept that our happiness is our own responsibility, not someone else's. Now, let's explore together how we can cultivate this inner joy, this self-sufficiency, and happiness. Let's learn to appreciate the silence, the peace, and the profound clarity that come when we are alone with our thoughts. In our quest to learn how to be happy alone, a vital component is personal development. Personal development is not just about acquiring skills or knowledge, it's about evolving into the best version of ourselves. It's a journey that is deeply personal, infinitely rewarding, and a cornerstone of finding joy in our own company. The relationship you have with yourself is the foundation of all the relationships in your life. When you invest in yourself through personal development, you are nurturing your soul and honoring your existence. It's the soil in which the seeds of self-contentment and happiness grow. This journey of personal development starts with self-awareness. Understand your strengths and weaknesses, your passions and fears. Look within and ask yourself what makes you tick, what do you need to grow, and what do you want. This level of introspection is the first step towards meaningful growth. Next is the pursuit of your passions. Everyone has something that sets their soul on fire, something that gives them immense joy. It might be painting, writing, cooking, programming, teaching, the list is endless. Identify that passion and pursue it. Your passion is your personal treasure, a source of joy that is uniquely yours. Expanding your knowledge and skills is another aspect of personal development. This doesn't necessarily mean formal education, it could be reading books, attending workshops, learning a new language, or mastering a new hobby. Keep your mind active, curious, and engaged. An engaged mind is a happy mind, one that finds joy in exploration and learning. Physical well-being is equally important in personal development. Taking care of your body through regular exercise, healthy eating, and sufficient rest is crucial for your mental and emotional well-being. When you are physically healthy, you are more capable of enjoying your solitude and more equipped to pursue your passions. Personal development is not always a smooth journey. There will be challenges, setbacks, and moments of doubt. However, these are not signs of failure, they are opportunities for growth. Every challenge you overcome, every obstacle you conquer makes you stronger and more resilient. It builds your character, enhances your self-esteem, and boosts your confidence. Remember, personal development is a continuous process, a lifelong journey. It doesn't have an end point, it's about constant growth, constant evolution. 
It's about becoming a little better each day, not just for yourself but also for those around you. When you are the best version of yourself, you bring that best to everything you do and to everyone you interact with. Embrace personal development as a key to unlocking your happiness in solitude. Invest time and effort in understanding and improving yourself. Explore new interests, learn new skills, take care of your body and mind. In doing so, you will find that being alone is not a state of emptiness but a state of opportunity, an opportunity to grow, to learn, and to flourish. Before Discipline go, is not just about hard work, that it's about like smart button. work, prioritizing and tasks, to this channel, focusing on what's truly important, so you won't miss any and of making the videos. most of your time and resources. This shows YouTube Be consistent that you in your efforts, our unwavering in your commitment, and, it helps and disciplined us spread the in your approach. Sharing now, is caring. let's talk about the power of 